Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Inside A Gamer. Welcome back to Machinki. Now, Machinki is a transport game that I haven't played in a very, very long time. It's very similar to our Transport Fevers. Uh, this is obviously developed by one guy. He's done a fantastic job over the last seven years. Uh, he's been doing this on his own and with community support. And I think he's done an absolutely fantastic job. Machinki is a great, great game. Now, I want to get back into it because I've noticed that there was recently a big update. And that update is what you can see on the screen, the airplanes and airports. So I'm actually quite excited to see how they work. Uh, there's one thing they haven't had in the game. Uh, so yeah, we're going to go start a new game. I haven't played in a little while, but hopefully most things haven't changed. So we're going to start a new game. I'm going to go to a custom map because I have a great UK map here that I like. That has UK and Ireland. Obviously, being from Ireland, I like those kind of things. In the advance, make sure the tutorial is turned off. I don't think we need that. I think it will be okay. We start with a 2000 loan. Uh, we'll, we'll deal with that as it comes. Okay, so we're going to get straight into this game. Okay, everyone, so welcome to the map itself. Here we go. We're going to be doing the UK and Ireland, as I said before. It's a very simple game, just like Transport Fever. Uh, you'll start with items... Uh, that we need to then put into production so like you know the logs will need to go into planks then the planks will go into like a currency for us that we'll collect which i'll show you in a second now first things first let's change our portrait uh let's try and get someone that semi resembles me um yeah we're not in much luck here are we got that woman there look pretty scary hey, look, we're gonna go with this guy why not that that'll do that's uh big enough so here we can look at building hqs and stuff i'm not gonna do that just yet so what I want to show you is the early steam age. So these are the currencies I'm, I'm saying. So once we get the planks made, the planks would go to a tool shop. The tool shop would then create these. Same for the coal mines. They would have to go into some sort of manufacturing process. And again, we make these as currencies. And we use them to invest in either buying equipment or going up through the eras. Okay, so it's quite important. So to get out of the... Uh, to get into the steam age, there we go. We'd have to invest these, which I don't have. We only have money at the moment. So this is something that we do need to look at. So I like to kind of start an island. Uh, this is where I'm from, an island. Here's Galway Town. Um, I'm up here somewhere. And um, we've got Ross Common. These are quite close. So I think this is a good starting spot for us to get our first rail line going. I think it's very important that we do that. So if we go down here, you've got the construction mode, which brings you into this really cool mode. So we've got loads of options here. We can decorate even the towns. We can uh, give them more amenities and stuff. Uh, we will need to do that to expand, to grow. Now, the first thing I'll do is look at the modified terrain and loaded terrain, because here is where I want to put my station. Now, don't mind that it goes up in a bit of a hill. That's absolutely fine. But this is where my main line is going to go across uh, to Ross Common up here. And uh, I think it's better than it manipulating itself for the moment. So we've got down here, you've got your stations, your depots, your tunnels, your bridges, your, uh, your all your signs and stuff, your signals. And it's all quite self-explanatory. So, look, we're going to go here. I'm going to start with my station. And that's five blocks long. And as you can see, there was a blue area to this station. This is the catchment area. So, currently, it'll only take up these passengers. We will need to expand that. And that's something that we can do. Now, I do like to name my stations, especially the town ones. So, we know that this is Galway. And I'm going to call it Main because there might be another station here. And, that's, uh, and here you can see the extensions. You can buy different things that will give us different things. And as I said, you've got to look at these currencies. Uh, look, loading speeds and stuff like that. Income capacities, restaurants, signal boxes. It just There's loads that we can do here. We get to decorate it and other kind of cool things as well. And we'll look at all that in a minute. So the next station I want to put in then. I'm going to come up here to Ross Common. And uh, we do want to try and get some of these houses in here where possible. Now that's the main town. So if we had it... Uh, see, it's it's not uh, not an easy uh, spot at the moment. If I take away some of this, uh, let's go into our station then. Maybe we put uh, five block there. It's not catching too much of the area. Again, we're going to fix that in a minute. Then we can look at our line. So the line between the two of them, if we go up here, we want to make it so we don't tunnel or do anything. Like right now, you can see that that's going to make the ground go down. I don't want to do that. And very much like transport fever, sometimes you just got to take things slowly and we can manipulate it a little bit easier ourselves. Um, say sometimes. It's not always perfect. And there we go. Into there. It's not particularly straight, but it'll do the job. Next thing we need is a depot. Now, the depots are quite cool because, look, they will automatically connect to the lines themselves depending on uh, where you want them. And I think here's a nice little cubby hole for this one, actually. Uh, yep, there we go. Minus 60. So now this is where we will buy our trains and stuff. So we go to engines. You can see I've got my Thomas ones here. These are mods from the workshop. They're just quite good fun. 
So we got these, uh, 31, 40, 47. The Porter is probably the best one. The fuel is going to cost me a money. It can pull 55 tons. It'll have to do for the moment. Now we're going to the wagons. Uh, we got the coach cars or we got the Pullmans. It is kind of a tough one at the moment. What we should probably pull. I think if we put three coach cars on the back of this, it's going to be absolutely fine. And we're going to look at here. Now, because this is a basic route from one station to another, this train would automatically just go between them. But what we need to do is make sure we set its orders. So we're going to go from Galway, Main, And then we're going to go to uh, Roscommon, which I'm going to rename in a second. Now, you can tell it to load here, wait for full loading. No, we're not going to do that because we're not going to have the people to start with. Now, we're going to press start. I will rename Roscommon in a minute. Uh, let's have a look. at. We'll go back into the normal mode. Let's watch our little train pop out of its shed since this is our very first one. Now, we can ride on all the trains and stuff as well, which is cool. We're here currently in the 1920s. Try and get some nice pictures. Okay, so he's going to head over to Galway Station, which is just down here. He's going to do his thing. I'm going to zoom out there for a minute. So train one. Now, we've got currently 13 passengers waiting here. So that's why at the moment I don't want it to do the full waiting because uh, it would be there a while. Now, we've got to be careful here. We will get things that will uh, give us what we want as well. will give us extra challenges. I don't think I disabled them. I hope I didn't because they're worth good money there. So there we go. He's going to load up. He's going to turn and burn. I'm only going to make 9.1 on, on this run. It's not great. But now, we are going to improve that very quickly. So first of all, Station 2 uh, needs to be named uh, Roscommon. There we go. Now, on the extensions, the one extension I want to do is a uh, waiting room. Because look, the catchment area increases by 2. So look at that. I've already now taken a lot of Roscommon. And that was going to cost me 100, but look, this should drive these up in a couple of runs, okay? Is he struggling pulling the three uh, the three coaches? Might have been a bad idea. We'll, we'll have a look at it again in a minute. And I'm going to put the same extension onto the Galway. And look, you can put it wherever you want, as long as it's touching a, a tile of the station. That is fine. I'm actually tempted to put it there. So I'm thinking if we go into that build mode, why don't we demolish this road for a minute? It's uh, We can build more roads if need be. And then we'll look at the waiting room and I'm going to put it there. And look at the catchment area now. It's got a lot bigger and the waiting room has a capacity of 500 too. So, and the loading speed is now 100% increased. All right, what we'll do is uh, we'll obviously turn up the speed a little bit here. So, look, Roscommon now has 32 waiting for the next return. And now, look, I'm making 23 coins on the next one. You can see it is burning fuel, minus one, every so many... I don't know, is it every day in the game or what? I don't know how it's working it out. But uh, you see it will burn fuel. So, we know that this is making profit. Look, there's now 36 waiting at Galway. And the more that they start shifting, you can see here that this will get... Busier and busier and busier. And we will probably have to put in a second line at some point. Now, there are other things that we can do here with, like, post and stuff as well, which we will look at once we go through the areas a little bit. We will definitely have a look at a bit more. Why am I not getting any quests? I did think I turned the quests on. I just want to just check it quickly. Okay, I didn't find anything there that will help me in any turns. But okay, so look, 26 coins. We've got 50 now waiting at Galway. 45 is my max. So that's going to make 28 a turn. And that, we're just going to let it do its thing for the moment. You know, it's okay. It's making a little bit of money. We're not getting rich or anything, but it's making some money. So I need to really look at making wood and planks. So where is the nearest tool shop? Now, I know Limerick has a tool shop. It's got this little hammer here. And so does Belfast. Now, Belfast, unfortunately... Logging, yeah, there's nothing really in that area at the moment. So the best one we can see here probably would be Galway, then down to Limerick. See, now we've got a delivery of logs. So we go our first thing. If we deliver 100 logs, we'll get $100 uh, investment. Okay. So, yeah, let, let's keep working on Galway as my area then. So we've got a forest here. 
we might have to uh, do a bit of work on the uh, ground let's have a look then so if we put a station near the forest it's only got to be in its catchment area as you can see okay i am going to have to manipulate some ground here don't like manipulating ground too much but uh oh instead i've just made a hill there there we go so that'll give us a decent line to go up and around with it's a start trade okay i found myself surplus of resources do any of the following interest you so i could get for 350 dollars i could get 100 coins or i could take silver um i'm actually i'm gonna take that that coal and now we got a new delivery of coal reward and that's fine um because we're making money so that's the main thing so i'm gonna put five as the platform and that's platform three and we're going to want to do the same up here in galway uh, this is a nice level bit so we, it needs to be close enough to this tool shed there it goes just touching so that's going to work out fine i'm going to put a little bit of road down just to uh so it's touching for now i suppose okay so this one i'm going to put down as uh, the galway cargo And, uh, well, this is in County Clare, but I'm just going to call this... Um, as you see now, look, it's loading up its logs. Now, we can change this to have more logs at holding. At the moment, it'll only hold 200, and it's quite slow, as you can see. Uh, station 3, where are you? It's you. Um, so, we're going to call this... I know we're not in Galway. Oh, hang on. But I'll just call this the, the Galway Forest, because it's the closest, and that's the line I'm going to connect this to. Okay, so we're going to get our train station line. I've got 870 uh, coins left. Got to be careful here. Okay, so that is the uh, straight line up, is it? It does look like it, right? There you go. So that line is connected. We will need a depot. I'm going to need to think about where I'm going to place this depot, actually, because I'm going to need a second track going down to Limerick at some point. I'm going to put that here for now. It might change. So I'm going to get another porter, and in its wagons, we're going to get logging. I think it can take four. I can't see why it would not take four. Okay, so we're going to go from the Galway Forest, and you're going to go up to there. Absolutely fine. Let's start your orders. So there we go. He's now going to go collect these logs. He can take 24 at a time. There's 81 here currently. And again, we will invest, upgrade. It's all going to happen. I need a little bit of money to be honest with you so that will go up to here so he'll change three wood into two plank that's how it'll work and then goy here will start taking in some more bits and pieces now ross common has 80 people to move boy main 80 okay are there any two towns pretty damn close to each other that maybe we can uh, get a little route going just to make some money okay what do we got here this should be uh oh that's truly I'd say that's Cork. I suppose that is Limerick. Cork is here, isn't it? That's probably Cork. Right. Yeah. So we do have a couple of towns. Now, maybe somewhere like here. we got Drogheda and Dundalk, and that will head into Dublin too. Like, they're very close. Now, the ground is... Uh, poor. That ground is not pretty, though. This is the only problem with Ireland. We're very lumpy. He's only making... Uh, look, I think we might be okay. Um... But yes, we definitely want another passenger line thrown in. So let's have a look over at the UK. So we've got little towns like Coventry and Birmingham. Okay, yeah, you know what? Why don't we get our first stations built down in this area? If we can work it out. So if we put a station into Birmingham, we'll make it five. And I'm going to do the same into Coventry, but I'm going to put Coventry's down here. And then we're going to manipulate the ground. So that bit there is level at least. And then we can move between here and here. Oh god. Never 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 as nice as you want it to be. I've got to manipulate it a little bit. And like that. There we go. So we've got a nice little station going on there. We'll get another little depot. We can build a depot into the town itself. That's fine. So what we'll do then, let's buy a port up. And I'm gonna actually buy some of the smaller wagons. Let's get three of them for now. I think I might have gone too big. Okay, 
I press start, he will do the orders because it's only two stations. But I want to just, uh, there we go, make sure that, that he's looked after. Oh, hang on. I just realized that train track isn't, uh, isn't fully uh, connected, is it? There we go. What's wondering? So let, let, let's rename you. Like I said, I do like to have my stations named. So we'll call you Birmingham. Um, might be spelled wrong. My my apologies. My spelling is not great. I know it's there in front of me as well. Um, okay, and then obviously you are Coventry. There we go. And we now have our first little train going between these two. It's very short, and short is sometimes better. Already in 1923, bloody hell. Now, he didn't pick up anybody, but Coventry is picking up passengers. So right now, that train's costing me money. Birmingham doesn't have anybody. Now, there's a few things that we can do here. We slow down the time. We know, if we click on Birmingham, I could put a waiting room on for 100. And maybe if I change how this road layout works... Uh, sorry, if we put the waiting room in then here. I am now going to get the catchment. And then what we can also still do is put the road going into that station. Now, that's going to be important for if we want to deliver posts and stuff. Like, there's a lot to this game. I mean, it's really, really cool. Now, the other thing we could do with the towns, if we click on Birmingham, I can go to extensions and you can put market saloons and we can put growers. So, so for £25, I can do this. So for $50 there, which is a lot of my money, People might move in, and it will help expand and grow our little station here. And look, it's made it's made some money. It's not going to make big money. And Birmingham's got two passages right now, but this will increase because now we're putting money into these shops at the wealth. So it's taking six this time away. Yeah, it's not going to make loads on the way down. But look, Coventry is already starting to load up. And I do have 100. So what I will do is actually put a waiting room into Coventry as well. And no, I'm going to put it maybe... You know what? That, that, that's fine. So. That's another train. It's another little line. And that will make us money if we put the speed up a little bit. We need to earn money. I need money right now. So as you can see, look, logs are being made. We're storing 70 right now, and I'm going to have to move them. And again, the only way to do that is going to have to be... Let's make another station block here. Okay, I think you can have up to three or four lines in a, in a station. But look at that. that that's, that's turning over nicely now. Uh, the problem I'm going to have, like I said, I'm going to have to delete the depot lines. And I did that at the exact wrong moment. Now he's going to go back there and waste time. Whoops. And this is going to have to go all the way down here. I mean, that's going to cost me 90. That's a lot of my money right now. I need to go to this tool work. So I'm going to leave it there for a second. Okay, deforestation. I contact you in the company because I need to know. I own a forest that was badly hit by the recent storm. Lots of our trees were knocked down. I've negotiated with a few sawmills to sell these logs quickly. Don't know how to use, uh, how to move as many logs. Okay, so it wants us to a forest near Belfast. This forest, they want us for a bonus to move it. Hang, well, hang on, that's in the Isle of Man. Uh, that's not easy because that's a big bridge. Okay, but that's fair enough. Maybe that is a cheap option just to get them bridged across. I don't know. We'll have to have a look at that in a minute. My money's kind of going back up a little bit. That's what I need right now. We need money. How's my delivering of logs? Okay, I'll collect that for my $100. And there you go, they're, they're producing. Okay, so what I need to do then is come down here. This tool works is where we need to put a station in. Okay, so yeah, it's in a freaking awkward place. Um, okay, that's okay, because it, it will it's still in the catchment area. So we'll put it into four. But unfortunately, I'm going to have to probably manipulate some of this land. 
Let's have a look. I'm gonna go too crazy here. All right, I think some needs to come up. I think I went down too low. Okay, I think that could be okay. I don't wanna go crazy, like I said. And then we can hopefully come in. No, you're gonna to wanna to tunnel down through that. So yeah, I need to probably lower more this side. Not easy to work out sometimes. Okay, let's give me a straight line through. Within reason. No, that's not going to work for us. Okay, so what needs to go up and down here? Uh, we put you down a bit. I think you probably need to go up. I think that's a smoother drop. Okay. It'll do. It's not pretty, but it'll do. So, unfortunately, this needs to be connected to a line. Best thing to do is just delete that depot and we'll put down another one. Because the other train will need maintenance via a depot. So, we'll put that in. And then we're going to have to uh, play around with these lines a little bit. So, make you come off and go on like that. Like so, and then we're going to need some signage. So we'll make you doubles, 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 and by double clicking we get doubles. So they can go up and down as they please. As you can see, he's clear to go. Uh, make reds because if he he needs to come into the depot, if we want to change him and upgrade him, we have to do it via the depot. So we'll have to do this. We, we won't have a choice. Okay, I've got a hundred. So look, we've got a new one now to deliver units. And okay, so we need to work on that, which is what we're doing now. Let's click on the depot then. We're going to get our engine. We're going to get our porter. And then within that porter, we're going to get the... Uh, the wood. We'll see if he can take four. I can't see why he can't. I want him to go from... Hang on. I'm just going to stop him there for a second. Orders. Go away cargo, and then I want you to come down to station 7 to start. Now I'm going to make this one... Now this is Limerick, but I think we'll make this Limerick... Uh... Well, we'll see. I'll call it Limerick for now. But it might just be the cargo. Okay, apparently I've hit caps lock along the way. Okay, so Limerick has its first station now. And we could put passengers onto this line. You know, there's no reason why I can't connect this through here. And this could also collect passengers. You know, it, it can it can work. All of this can work. So you can see now, look, I'm making currency. So he's dropped off his first load of logs. So for every four logs, I will get two currency of my timber. It's also helping me progress on this little subsidy here that it wants me to do as well. So that's all working out okay. Money is uh, coming in. I still have those loans that we need to think about. Now, Galway has a lot of plate people, and uh, so does Ross Common. So, the thing that we need to do here now is then. Pull this out. All the way down. It cost me most of my money. And then, I was hoping that we were going to connect it there, but that doesn't seem to be the case. We're going to probably have to connect it a little bit. Okay, pause that because I just broke his line. There we go. So that line is now connected. Now, the only way that we're going to do this is via... Um, putting our signals down. So you have to get it correct. So we'll make this the down line. And we might add more trains onto this. So I'm going to put in a couple of signals to get us going. You know, I'll probably put in another one. And again, down here, because that's our down line. And then this is going to be our up line. So up. We might as well put it very similar to it up. Up. And again, uh, the up line can sit 
so no one will block each other at the station that's the idea here and because of the way this one's done compared to this one i don't really need to put this signal junction in uh, because this train can go into there and then go into here now what we'll have to do is uh double stack them probably so we'll see how we go let's go back to uh pressing play on the on the game and go into depot one let's get another engine then and now i could make a baldwin here and that's exactly what i'm gonna do we're gonna get one baldwin and we're gonna put one two three cars on that and your order is gonna be from Galway, main up to ross common and start so now we got the baldwin i've just used all my currency there okay he's gonna go to ross common first as you can see the signals are gonna work automatically here for us he'll have to wait here now until he leaves that's absolutely fine now he'll go into the station time to progress okay we really need to invest in city of the stations but at least three extensions okay well we can do that so why did he not pick up anyone oh okay he's just wasted my money uh, because Galway was his first station instead of going out uh, he couldn't go that way he had to go that way sorry my bad so he's gonna make 28 a turn here now and you can see here woods coming in woods coming out we'll be making this currency and we got a subsidy here award for another train delivery of timbers coming along nicely deforestation is gonna be damn hard um but yeah i could nearly invest into the next age we're, we're very close to that already and just by opening up this very small line now it wants us to build more extensions and stuff um trying to think where might be the best place for these extensions let's have a look what galway has i mean we could put fright on here once we've got more logs being created so that's all good and remember these trains cost me money to run when they're just cargo so like these have to really pull their weight here and to be fair they're doing a good job I don't think there are any other extensions I can really put in that just cost me money at the moment. So, yeah, we'll just have to go with what we're going. Let's have a look at Birmingham Coventry. How are we looking over here, Birmingham Coventry? Yeah, look, we need bigger trains and more carriages here. We're now 244 and 84. And the easy thing here to probably do is just put in a second line. For whatever reason, we can't just go straight down. There we go. We do it like so. There's our little gap. And then we're going to look at... Uh... Okay, he's used that as his upline. So we'll use this as our upline. And then this can be our downline into that station. So I don't have to change him for a minute. I've got enough wood here to get another porter. So let's get... Uh... Uh, he uses two fuel compared to the one. Actually, you know what? Let's just get one more of these for a moment. And uh, we'll put three coach cars on them instead of the other one. So we've got kind of one small, one big. And we'll make them go Birmingham first then into Coventry and let's get him starting his journey so he can take 45 at a time look at that he's gonna make me 13.9 he'll have to wait look at that money is rolling in okay we can collect our subsidy reward which is 25 planks looking pretty good there so look just having this little thing running at coventry is uh working out quite well for us town is growing and again we can do things for these towns to help them like i said town grow area you know why not invest a little bit of money into some of these towns we we have all that money is now not becoming our biggest concern our biggest concern now would be let's move in people again so that's all working out quite well. 
for the short term. We could put a passenger train in from here to, to here as well. Look, there's 152 people waiting at this station. Okay, so the best thing we could do then is let's pull the line out. And it's going to have to be a big line, though. Uh, that's going to cost me 78 so far. I'm probably going to have to manipulate some of this ground. Problem with the colours. I can't always tell. Have I manipulated enough? There we go. No, not enough. And I'm probably going to have to raise it here. Just a little bit. Okay, that's fine. Uh, because, so that Limerick station has picked up passengers, so we may as well use it. You know, there's 170 here now waiting. So we need to have a look. This train's going to come down. Why did you go down that one? I'll make you the down line. And then you have to be the upline. Now you can put the automatic signals in that will signal every so often. It's up to you how you want to do it. Okay, so that should block that section off. Not pretty, but it should work. So if we could go from depot four, are we is are we collecting passengers here though? I, I can't see them. I don't think there's any people in the area. But it'll bring people up to Galway, so I'm sure it's going to make us money. 125 wood. I'm going to put the Baldwin in because it is faster. And I'm going to give it three coaches. And hang on. It needs to start from here. And then I want you to go down uh, to Limerick. Okay, now we can press start. Should all work out okay. We'll just see how this runs here now when we get down here. But he's gonna make me 39. And hopefully he's already on his way back. He is. Should be a straightforward drop people off here. Now we can probably build houses and stuff. If we go into the Galway catchment area, if we go into extensions, and if we say a grow area. In this little part here, we can put a bit of a road going down into their station. And to be honest, it doesn't matter as long as that train's making some money. We'll see how it goes. Uh, what else can we put in short term? A market. Look at that. So we put in our first market. We'll help the town grow as well. There's lots of things that we have to do. Now, we aren't really pulling all the passengers possible here, which is meaning that we need to grow our towns. Delivery of timber has now been done, so we can take that subsidy. Uh, I want to have a look here at Galway. I'm going to put in another one of them. And I want to put in another kind of couple of grow areas in this catchment area. Because... I want this part of the town to grow. How are we looking over here? We could actually progress now. We are ready. So Steam Age, I have my 100 coal. We could invest. I look, we can just click on them like that. And we're, then we're ready to go. But I'm going to wait for the next episode. I'm going to leave it there for you guys. Let me know what you think about Mashinki. Do you want to see some more? I love it. Um, every time I play Transport Fever, you guys never watch. I mean, saying that every time I play this, you never watch. It's these kind of games I wish you guys would love to watch a bit more because they're some of my favourites. But uh, hey, look, he's got passengers. Boy, Cargo has passengers. 
Hey, it might be time for uh, a waiting room expansion here. But we'll have to manipulate the ground. Uh, that's the only problem with that, because it's gone dead there. So if we put a waiting room onto here... There we go. So we can take passengers here. And we're now serving two parts of Galway City, which is good. But yeah, I'm quite excited for this. Let me know in the comments down below. Subscribe if you're new. Hit that like button. Come join us on Discord. Other than that, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.